In breaking news, first up, Hindu Sena Chief Vishnu Gupta has been detained by the Delhi Police. Gupta is now being questioned by the Delhi Police in connection with the Kerala House Canteen Rao. The Hindu Sena Chief had been detained for providing wrong information to the Delhi Police about beef that's being served at the Kerala Bhavan Canteen. Just to recall what happened yesterday, Vishnu Gupta had complained to the Delhi Police over beef that he said was being served at the Kerala house in the national capital. Meanwhile, the Chief Minister of Kerala, Uman Chandi, even asked the Delhi police to accept their mistake for allegedly raiding the Kerala Bhavan or else they would have to face legal action against themselves. Anindo Banerjee now joining us for more on this. Anindo, so finally the Delhi police cracking down on, you know, these Hindu hardliners and on Vishnu Gupta finally detaining him for further questioning. Absolutely, uh, Avantika, they, they, have, uh, detained, they have detained Vishnu Gupta right now and uh, they have been questioning him that why, uh, why did he uh, provide a wrong information in the first place. But uh, to be fair uh, to, uh, to the whole, uh, to, to clear the whole uh, air of confusion, uh, the, what, what was written on the on menu of, uh, of Kerala house was beef, was not specifically written as buffalo meat as it has been done today. So probably that uh, that uh, gave the birth to all the confusion. But having said that, it is not about the technicalities. It is not about a law and order. It has been a political issue right now. We have to realize it has blown out of proportion. You have all around uh, Delhi police sprinkle around. You have, if my camera person can show you the other side, CRPF, a bus full of CRPF is uh, st stationed all around this whole area. So that is the amount of sensitivity the whole matter has uh, uh, given birth to. Talking about the political aspect of uh, it uh, uh, Avantika today uh, Ahmadi pa just a few while back Ahmadi party leaders the top notch of Ahmadi or, uh, of the uh, of the uh, top brass of the party Ashutosh uh, the Kerala Kerala in charge of uh, Ahmadi party was also here uh, so uh, 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 they also they said that the uh, Delhi police reacted the way they have just because of the fact that uh, the, they have the backing of uh, the BJP. So it is taking a political turn. Even yesterday we were talking to a lot of uh, other parties as well. Venu Gopal of the Congress said that he will ra raise the matter in the coming, uh, coming session but of parliament. But Anindo, uh, you know, do you uh, see uh, the uh, detention uh, of, uh, you know, uh, Mr. Vishnu Gupta as an image-saving act by the Delhi police after, point, after fingers were pointed at, uh, you know, them uh, for overstepping their brief and, you know, without consulting uh, the Kerala house uh, landing up there and raiding Kerala house. Definitely, uh, to, uh, to uh, you know. Uh, we can't defend uh, the Delhi police beyond a point because of the simple fact that Delhi police didn't follow the standard operating procedure. The standard operating procedure is that when you enter a, organi enter a house like this, you first have to go to the resident commission and seek permission. Then, all, exactly. then only you can head towards the kitchen. They headed straight to the kitchen. So that is a violation of the well laid out procedure and that's why it's a uh, face saving exercise as you rightly said. And wh what we believed from, uh, uh, what, we, what we get to know from our sources that yesterday around uh, evening, uh, officials high ranking officials from the within the pmo called up uh, bs Basti and uh, pulled him up for the way uh, for the reaction they uh, because they landed here with as much as 20 personnel which is unprecedented for a complaint like this that too of a complaint on, on a complaint of a fringe element All so right. that is definitely a, a face saving exercise okay anindo just uh, stay with us we're getting in some more breaking news right now